I think you should pay close attention to the other students in your class that um, you admire and respect and are inspired by. I mean, in your case, you say you've done some work, so I would pay attention to the people you've done work with that inspire you, uh, feel like they're of like mind and like interest, because my whole thing started really with, at Strasbourg, there was a couple of people that I met who, some of whom I still work with today. I mean, this is going back, you know, 1983. Um, and from the class, we started meeting on our own um, on, on weekends to do improv theater. Just like, in, not comedy, but like, you know, to, to kind of work on our stuff outside of class. And, and what happened was eventually one of the students started writing and started getting interested in directing and we got the rights to an Arthur Miller play. And I produced, I was 21 or 22, I produced my first play. He directed it, we got a bunch, some students and some other people through word of mouth, sc scraped and scra you know, scrambled to put some money together, rented a theater, put on Incident of Ishii. Then he's, he was writing at the same time and the next thing we did was a one act that he wrote. And it kind of, you know, my first agent I got because I, the one student had an audition for an agent and she wanted to do the scene we were doing in class for the agent and the agent signed both <laughs> of us. So create your own opportunity. Find your own peer group. Yeah. Um, a, that's a big one. I mean, and, and um, you know, someone might be doing a short film and you do, you know, and it's, I, I think that's really, really important. Um, and B, I always say this, an actor has to find a way to work. And that can mean here at Strasbourg in class. That can mean, you know, making your own video. You know, back when I was 17, there was no video cameras, you know, there, or there were for the news or something. You didn't really own them. Yeah, yeah. Maybe they just started, you know, so people weren't. You know, I did an NYU film, I think, when I was 19, but nobody really had their own equipment. I mean, it was very, very different. Now, you can do it on your iPhone, which everybody has. So, and you can actually put it online where, where strangers can see it, if, if you can steer them there somehow. So, an actor has to find a way to work, you know, and, and be it in class or be it in, in putting up your own stuff. Um, but I would really focus on whatever environment you're in, class, or whatever job you get as an actor, somebody kind of turns you on or inspires you, you feel like you're in like mind, investigate.